Dick Smith backs Pauline Hansen's plan for one nation state election blitz. Pauline Hansen has thanked multimillionaire Dick Smith for throwing his support behind One Nation as the party prepares for an electoral assault in upcoming state and federal elections. <music> Senators Pauline Hansen and Darren Hinch have clashed over the backpacker tax. Courtesy. Sunrise. The opinionated patriot and former Australian of the Year says he is aligned with Ms. Hansen on her tough immigration stance and other policy positions and will meet with the first-time senator before Christmas to formally offer his backing. The pair had an initial conversation last week where Ms. Hansen said Mr. Smith realized we agree on many things. I support her policy on Julian Assange. I support her immigration policy. She says that she's going to have a policy to help general aviation. He'll certainly support that, Mr. Smith told the Daily Telegraph. I agree with her views on immigration numbers, that is about 70,000 a year, not 200,000. But I do not agree with her views on Muslim immigration. The former electronics retailer ruled out financially backing One Nation, but said he would give her some suggestions and help secure tens of thousands of votes. Myself and the aircraft owners and pilots will come up with what needs to be done, and I will give her some suggestions," he said. I think she would get tens of thousands of votes from the aviation community because they have been let down by the Alpen liberals. Mr. Smith, who is passionate about curbing population growth, said he believes a tough immigration stance like Hansen's would help young people afford houses. He said he believes voters are so disillusioned with our present party politics and that a one-nation candidates would win seats, particularly in western Sydney, at the next state election. One Nation is planning a major campaign in western Sydney at the next state and federal elections. The party has similar plans in Queensland. The One Nation leader has predicted a Trump-like wave of support for the conservative alternative across the nation. I think there's a move on across the country for One Nation, Ms. Hansen told The Telegraph. The controversial senator took to Facebook this morning to thank Mr. Smith for his support. Like many other Australians, when Dick Smith took the time to listen to what I had to say and look at my actual policies he realized we agreed on many things, she said. I look forward to working with him more in the future. In lending his support, Mr. Smith acknowledged controversy around Ms. Hansen's views on Muslim immigration and past comments around Indigenous Australians. People tend to say that she's racist. So I asked her, does she think that she's superior to other races? She said no, he said.